just jump in and just talk and just being ourselves, man. Listen, listen. All right, this is your boy, Raw, coming at you, Raw. What's up, y'all? This is my boy, Fresh. We back at it again. Say something, Fresh. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. What's going on, YouTube? Fresh Prince of Gamer. We up in here right now. We're all sitting up there cracking up. I don't know why. I'm Maybe cracking up because we we started this podcast literally a second ago, and Fresh just let out a big what. I'm like, what? No, we can't, we can't start the pod, we can't start this off. And this is not a podcast per se. This is just gaming talk, playing the game we're playing. And it, it, this is we're playing Destiny, but the gaming talk is going to be all over the place. It's not going to be only about Destiny. Um, and we might not talk about nothing on that. The only thing about Destiny we may talk about is, hey, uh, make sure you know you do this or that, or go here or there. But yes, sir. We're gonna start this. We're gonna start this bad boy off by talking about That's something that we j- <laughs> stop it. We're gonna talk about Metal Gear actually. Um, a lot of players, fresh has uh, well, not a lot, but uh, a good handful, right? Have said Metal Gear um, it, it, it's great, and, yeah, and, and, good, and, good numbers. And, and good numbers say that. Now there are also are. people who say. Metal Gear is repetitive. All right, like you're at the same places over and over, and you're doing the same thing over and over. Now look, we're not gonna be Metal Gear fanboys in this mug. We're gonna say what it is. We're gonna be true. We're gonna be real, but we're also gonna justify it in places we believe it should be justified. Right? Um, as far as it being repetitive, saying you do the same thing over and over. Uh, over and over again in the same area over and over again now you do fresh you you, you do you know what uh, i mean it, 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 I they mean, ain't lying no no that's a, that's a lie it's, <laughs> it's your choice of doing the same thing you know what i'm saying like it's kind of like life a little bit it's like how do you want to tackle tomorrow like would you do it the same way you did it yesterday like yesterday um just say just just say for instance i went to work yesterday hmm. no i didn't I, I went to work yesterday. Am I going to do the same thing? Am I going to walk the same aisles like I did yesterday? Mm. You have a choice on what you want to do in Metal Gear Solid, like you do in life. Like I want to instead of instead of me just killing everybody's stuff, I can go in loud. I can go in this. I can do it this way. I can crawl my way through, and nobody can never see me. Like things like that. He, he, he like Kojima tries to um make the game more. Not even just option when it comes to oh go stealth. Yeah, or go loud. No, man, it, it it comes everything. Walking paths and with the things you might find, what kind of posts you might find, you know, what uh, what you might find a diamond somewhere, like because you, I don't know, you just want to go some other way, like a secret way that, you know. But wait, 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 wait. Let me say this. You're right. You could go about it in different ways, and that's what we're here yeah. to argue. Um, for those guys who say Metal Gear is repetitive. Now, look, it's re- anything yeah, becomes repetitive. <laughs> let me say this: anything is repetitive if you let it be. Like, yeah, if you, fine, if you, you, if you are playing the game using different guns every time you go in. Or no, let's just go the negative route. Hey, fresh! I found the chest. Um, let's say, let's say oh, you okay. go, you you go, you go in um, the the game mode. Always with the same loadout, always with the same buddy, going to the same places over and over and over again. Like, dude, I was upgrading, I was upgrading some stuff in Metal Gear, upgrading some stuff in Metal Gear, and bruh, like, the guns are plentiful. Like, there's so many guns in Metal Gear that you would say, man, dog, like, this is nuts. Like, you don't need to do this. Like, I could get the job done with just my auto rifle, right? That, that auto rifle you start off with, and you can upgrade. Yeah. Now, first, while we're doing this, you do patrol missions. You don't, you don't need to be right here. You go ahead and do patrol missions, and you go do that to the fullest. You're strong enough. I'm going to leave you to it. Fresh, you got to move. Yes, sir. Go. Go. Do patrol missions. You don't need to be here. Remember, you're here for patrol missions. Go ahead, and if a public event happens, I'll call you to go get it. But I'm a, I, I got I to gotta stay here to... Uh, get my bounties done and I'm gonna meet you um, but anyway uh, going back to what I was saying like the guns in Metal Gear is plentiful 
Like, there's so many guns in that game. Like, if you're doing the same thing, over using the same lot over and over, yeah, it'll be repetitive. But I'm not doing that. I'm playing this smart. I'm playing it with the longevity mindset. Like, I want to play this for a while. Uh, the way you do that, in my opinion, is to change up your, your, your loadout. Get a shotgun, run in there doing shotguns, or run in there with a sniper that puts people to sleep. Like, mm -hmm. the latest mission I just did, right? I did this mission, and it went sour. And instead of saying, oh, let me restart it so I can get an S rank, I said, screw. Let me go ahead and all the way. And, bro, hey, uh, Fresh, you see where it says hard? Oh, wait. It's killing these guys, giving us it? Okay, cool, never mind. Um, but like I said, the mission went salt, and I called my helicopter, my backup helicopter. And let me tell you this. I felt like Rambo in the action flick. Like, it really felt like that. I I had a helicopter. It went down. It died. But, bro, I, I got to jump on the enemy. While they were paying attention to my helicopter, I went up behind them and, and, and jumped in one of those walkers and was just ripping them a new one. Right? That's what and, I'm saying. Like, um, things like that, man. And I never and I never did that before. I never did it that way before. And, and I think that's what keeps Metagear from becoming repetitive for me. You got to play it right. Yeah. You got to play it right. You got to play it right. That game, listen, as long as you play it right, that game will always be fresh. There you go, fresh. <laughs> yes, sir. So, yeah, yeah man. And, I don't think it's repetitive. Yeah, I, 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 only if you it make it like repetitive. Hero, man. Only... Yeah, yeah. You know, any yeah. game could be repetitive. Like if you were to jump in Call of Duty with the same loadout, the same gun, the same tactics, it's gonna become repetitive. It's gonna be boring. So any game could be repetitive. You yeah, know, like Destiny. Like I'm like that's listen. Like Destiny, it can be repetitive. Yes. Let me tell you why. If you go, if yes. you go up in the same area with the same gun. Yeah, that's repetitive. If I go up in there with some uh. Some some crazy armor and all that, and I'm feeling I'm feeling stronger. That changes the whole entire game, and that's that's a change right there. Like so, I don't want to hear like, oh, oh, like you said, every game is repetitive. Everything. Every, every game, game could be. be repetitive if you right. don't progress. If you don't progress and, 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 and you don't try out new things, like yeah, it'll get stale. Another way of saying it. Yeah. So yeah, man, like, those yeah, those saying. players, those oh, the taking are here. We got to do this fresh. Um, right. okay, kill some of those, um, knuckleheads, and, t until a lieutenant spawns in. Like, uh, like these old, like old games back in the day, man, like, we never could, we never stopped playing those games, like those old ones. Like, oh, it's snap, Johnny Hunt original. just sent me a, fr uh, a party invite, it's been a while since we, oh, let me say this, let me say this, uh, he ain't ready for the podcast yet, what you say? He ain't ready for this? No, not yet. Not yet. We'll keep it just uh two v two. Oh, one v one. One v one. We'll we'll keep them. We'll keep them in our thoughts. But uh let's look for a lieutenant now. But yeah, any game could be well, repetitive. Play Metal Gear too, though. But you know, it is what it is. Oh we'll, snap! We'll another one. Oh snap, dude! This saying trying to reconnect. Are you still on Mars? Wait. Oh, it, it 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 killed me. You see where I'm at, like. Yeah, it, it killed me. <laughs> yeah. Oh, a lieutenant right here. Come by with me. Lieutenant? Alright, I'm right over. Alright, we got him. Alright, looking for another lieutenant. But yeah, those players who think Metal Gear is repetitive, I hope we um, helped you on proving that it, it, any game could be repetitive. Any but game. The next thing on the list to talk about is, like we talked about it earlier, we talked about how uh, Far Cry and all these other games, uh, as far as open world goes, we talked about the definition of open world game right and my definition is kind of different from your definition your uh -huh. definition of an open world game is literally if I can go left and right that's open world <laughs> that's what it seems that your nah, definition nah. is <laughs> nah, man. when I say when I listen when I'm when I mean an open world I mean let me say this like 
I know what you're gonna say too. Cause <laughs> GTA Five is an open world when it comes to you know the media, but or when it comes to the industry. But it's not GTA Five is not really an open world. You can't even come on. It's supposed to be the city. Of, it's supposed to be a city of California. California, period. That's supposed to be there. Just California. That's it. That's yeah. Why? Why is only California and there's not nothing else attached to it? That's not an open world because in real life, California, you got come on now, you got Vegas and all that right there. They don't got Vegas in uh, GTA Five. Let me say this like, because you can't, you can't go. You can't go the other way. Why can't I go that way? Why it always got to be water? I want to step somewhere. I want to. I want to go somewhere else. I want to glitch to Liberty City. I want to. I want to go somewhere else. Like why can't I do this? Not open world. Let me say this. Like what? You basically like, like you want to go somewhere go. totally different. Like GTA, I'll give you this. Like you are always going to be in California or in that landscape. Like if you go somewhere else, it's not like there's no place in GTA that's snowing or it, everything. I ain't gonna say everything looks the same because that's not true. You know, you got the city and, and you got the Blaine County in the desert. But like if if they if they made a scene more open, like there is a place where it, it looked at so different from all the other places, maybe that might uh, be where you might say, yeah, you yeah yeah, that's what I'm talking about. But what I'm trying to say is versus games like Far Cry, which claim to be open world, and I I agree that it's open world to an extent, but like Destiny, this this game right here, this is open space. This is not open world. It's bigger than Halo. Yes, you know how you were saying Metal Gear is bigger than any Metal Gear. So that's why, uh, you, you know, you gave it you gave it um the title of being the, the bigger the biggest Metal Gear ever. Well, Destiny yeah. is bigger than Halo. You know, even though it's not open world, but it's way, 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 way bigger than Halo now versus um, uh, uh, a GTA or uh, another game is it, smaller. Like Witcher 3 or Fallout 4. Yeah, Destiny is smaller. But compared to the last game, it's huge, but it's still open space. I don't want to call it open world Halo. I'm just calling it a, a, a open space game like Fable, and I'm not saying I want to just stress. I'm not saying Fallout 4 is. I say Fallout 4. You know what I mean? I mean um. Far Cry 4, like. Yeah. I mean, I mean, I, I'm gonna say this like, open world. Saying that like, that's that. That they they you know they want more sales. When you hear a game that's open world, you're like, oh, I want to know what this is. Like, what can you do in this world? That's the first thing that you think about. What can I do in this world? What, what's, what's, what is the difference between this open world and other open world games? You know what I'm saying? It's like, that's the first thing that I think about. Like, you, come on now. Like, open world is a, that's a, that word is false. That's false. Open world, you know what's a true wor open world game is? No Man's uh, Sky. That's no Man's Sky. <laughs> that's not even. That's not even open world. That's like open, open universe. Plus open world plus open universe. That's <laughs> open world plus open universe. Because he said they're a size planet. He said they're planet size. Planet size slash planet size planets. You know what I'm saying? Like, and you got all these other universes to go to. That's a true meaning of open world mm -hmm. slash open universe. Like games like Far Cry. That's their open world that they created. That's their yeah. world. Like on Earth. Yeah. We can go anywhere we want it, honestly. We can go anywhere. It doesn't matter where it is. We can go anywhere. Like, we don't have... Uh, well, when it comes to the law, we do got boundaries. But, hey, guess what? These games, man... It, like, Far Cry. Oh, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me go back to Metal Gear real quick. Because we got to talk about this, too. Because we forgot about this. Use Ground Zeroes. We was talking about Ground Zeroes. Now... Hold on, hold on. We are going we, we to... We're going to come back to open world definitions and uh, to be honest to, let's just finish off this i i, I agree with you I'm, 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 I'm i agree with you because i came into this uh conversation saying yeah uh we, hold up, keep doing patrol missions bro uh i came into this conversation that saying that open world means this no no open world <laughs> it doesn't mean gta that's what, literally what i was going with Open world doesn't mean GTA. <laughs> open world means <laughs> you're open to the developer's world. And their world, 
like in Rockstar's world with Rock, with GTA 5, Rockstar's world with GTA 5 consists of that island and water. Their world is Far Cry. I mean, Ubisoft. That's their world. Everything that consists of that area in Far Cry. That's their world. Destiny. I say, I say, open space versus open world. Open world has open space in it. Like you just converted me into your mindset just now because you got to think of it like that like these developers like this is their universe this is their world like the only true open world game is like like you said no man's sky where the only true like literal open world game is that yeah literal literal open world now the the <clears throat> the next then then i try to tend back to going on my on my thoughts exactly where i say it's not open world it's open space but I'm gonna go on your yeah, way of thinking. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna exactly. So I'm gonna go on your way of thinking. You you got me. You got me. I'm gonna give this one nah. a fresh. No no no. You you got me. It, it it's kind of hard because I for the longest I've been, I've been um. I made a video about this like open world. Yeah. What is open world? And 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 I might have to uh, now look. If you want to see that video, go watch video. But I did stress out some good points on that video, but. For yeah. the sake of argument, let's let's just yeah let's just call open no, world I, what the developer makes yeah and, and, and allows know, us to go why, to. You know why you saying that? Like when you say the open world, it's because they these game developers are so good at making you believe it. That's the whole point. Of, the whole point of it. So it is an open world. Honestly, it really is. Mm. It's just not. It's just not a literal way of. So it's not like, a literal to, open world. Mm. To get you to, it's why it's, it's, all this is make believe. Everything is make believe. It's 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 good. They got you. That's what it is. They got me too. But I still know. Like now we know what it is. Like of course, but it's still make believe. So it's mm. not really an open world. So if I can't go to another planet, I can't. Hey, come on now. hey like, fight these taken. Fight these taken. Um, kill the lieutenants. I, I'm doing the patrol. Oh oh, oh, do the patrol. Do the patrol. I'm sorry. Yes, sir. We did. Is it? It's over. Alright, come out here then. Yeah, the open world, man. And then, so um, Destiny Destiny is open world. Because yeah. it, it, it it's Bungie's world that's open. Yeah. Okay. The, you really know what yeah, and like and you know, they, they probably was excited about this game. They was like, you know what, this is an open world game. Like look at all this. They excited to create something new instead of linear Halo. You know what I'm saying? It's, this is new to them, so of course they're gonna call it an open world. It is. It is, but it's still open space. It's not like I can go to different planets or. You could go to you different know, planets. Different continent. Well, different continents. What I'm talking about. Well, to say. in a way, it, 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 a different planet is a different continent. In a way. Nah, uh, man. <laughs> Let me say this. Let me say this. Let me say this. You're going back. You're going back to my belief but let's not do that let's not do that let's not go back to my belief no. let's let's just say a open world game is when you have freedom to go left and right and around the corner without it being linear and destiny is not linear now it, ha it has small places no. and hey you got to help come help me since you're here um i know you want to do those patrol missions but you know when you're here help me out can't, can't do it all right go do the patrol missions man you're gonna leave me hanging I'm right here. I'm right with you. You just yeah. said you want to leave me. No. He said no. All right. Anyway, yeah, this open this is open world bungee game because you can go anywhere you want to, but you can't go anywhere you want to. In GTA, you can go anywhere you want to, but you can't go anywhere you want to. Like I can't go in all the buildings. You know, you can go in. There you go. That's the definition of open world. Where you yeah. could go anywhere you want to, but you can't go anywhere you want to. And that's the definition yeah. of open world gaming. Now, some, yeah, go ahead. Some some games, like... Are bigger than others. Some, some, some games are bigger yeah, than others. Some, some games have a bigger scale than others do. Like, say Oh, instance, crap, dude. The Z-Lot's uh, here, man. Get out of there. Oh, snap. Like, say, for instance, um, one of my favorite developers, um, Kevin Ke uh, Ken Levine. Ke Ken Levine, who made Bioshock. Um, Bioshock Infinite. Let me say this. Like, he's the creator of Bioshock. Like, that's one of my favorite games of all the time. Like, Fresh, know, why you ran that far? Like, I need help. Like, no, the Z-Lot was shooting me up like crazy. Like, 
Ken Levine is one of my favorite, uh, you know, game developers and stuff like that. Like, he's he's creator of Bioshock. Let me say this. He said he's creating a, a small-scale open-world game. Like, he always, this man is always doing something different. He's not trying to make the biggest game in the world. Like, he, he's saying that right off the bat. I'm making a small-scale open-world game. Like, he, he, he's telling, kept telling us what we, where we're getting. He's not going to mm. lie and say, oh, yeah, this is an open world. And then when we get the game, oh, it's not really, it's not that big. So how is it open? Jump, 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 jump. Say, but okay, saying, but let me say this. Saying I'm going to make a small open world game is being literal. Still calling, it, it's still an open world. Like, if you, if it's not linear, it's open. You get what I mean? Like, if it's not yeah. linear, it's open. And we're in this world. Right now, we're in Mars. We're in Destiny's world right now. We're in the Destiny universe right now. And we are not putting enough damage on this Blight. This this Blight Descendant. Like I want to. Do you super? Do all your crap? Hey, put weapons of light on. What the heck? Is, are you? Do you have armor or weapons? Or what? Armor? Oh dear. Alright, make sure you're hitting that, that blight. Blight? That's what they call it, a blight. Descendant. Oh my goodness. We gotta put more D on my. Yo, I just want to quickly say that I lost some footage after this clip, so it's just going to go straight into the next part of the conversation. But yeah, I'm sorry, I uh, lost that footage. Um, but like I said, this soon after this clip ends, it goes straight into the next one. Thank you. They don't know that I'm there. I plant every C4 there. Now, I'm all the way inside of the facility building. Now, I don't want them to come in the building where I am. So this is what I do. All that C4 that I put outside, I'm going to blow it up while I'm inside the building, so they can't walk around that building no more. So I can. So they all leave the building to go see what's yeah, outside. So they leave the building. That's what I'm saying. Like things like that. Like it, the C4 don't disappear. Like it's yeah. still there. You planted it, and it's going to blow up if, if you, you press, press the button. Explosive. It's over. That's what I'm saying. Like it's over. That that right there, that you could you could do a lot of things that's tactical. You got to have that tactical mind. To, mm. to tackle Metal Gear Solid 5 instead of just going loud or oh it's just a, a stealth game like it, it is a stealth game but you can also do different things to go about it like combat and stuff like that like it might not have the best combat but man I do I still love that snake move that he do man that that move is nice man that it's snake good. move it make you feel like an action hero yeah when he be when he do that fast punch thing and he knock him down that's cool man like seriously you can knock him into the wall and stuff oh like, yeah 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 it's good man. Like it, it, like it, it doesn't have a variety of combat, but it's still good. It's a, I mean, it's a, it's a third person. It's basically a third person shooter, man. It is. It's a stealth third person shooter. That's what Metal Gear Solid is. And like, think about it like this: you got Afghanistan and Africa, and you could tackle Afghanistan different ways and Africa different ways. It's yeah. ridiculous. And let's not let's not mention the D Walker. D Walker, you can go on stealth. You got, come on, man. It's, it's you can you call it strike. You can call in your helicopter to help you out. Come on now, it's, it's mm. millions of things that you could do to tackle a situation. You need help, you can call your helicopter. What games you know right now you can do that? You can call your helicopter. Like, I can't, you can't do that in most games. You yeah. Help. Like, I, if I, I wish I could do that in Destiny. Like, you call a helicopter. Like my ship, like my uh, ship. Yeah. Like I, I, I bought, I, like, I bought guns for my ship. So, like, my ship can just drop something. Like, start helping me. Like, that'd, that'd be, be cool. Like, that's like Destiny 2 type stuff. stuff. Yeah, that's Destiny 2 type stuff. Like, like Destiny, you know it'd be cool if I had like a little, I was about to say like a little cell phone, but you know you got your little thing he you talks to you. Your ghost is basically your cell phone. That'd be cool <laughs> though. But if you had your own like hologram phone and you can look at it with your hand. Like, <laughs> <laughs> say that again. Say that again. Yeah, right. Make it feel like it's you. What would you? Hold up, hold up. Say that again though. What? Say what you said again. No, I said it's up to you if it's repetitive. Like, I mean, you playing it wrong. That's right. That's right. You're playing it wrong if you think any game is repetitive. You're playing it wrong. You're playing it the same way you did before. That's all it. That's it. That's all she wrote? Yeah, y'all, listen. 
It's all in your imagination, man. If you limit your imagination, that's it. Yeah, <laughs> you said no good. That's it. No good. So yeah, y'all. Um, that's the video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you guys uh continue to support us in this this thing we like to do, talk about video games. And this has been Raw coming at you raw. This has been fresh. Say pieces to the folk. Coming at you fresh. Woo! <laughs> uh, <laughs> Check me out, guys. Prince the gamer. I make sure I'm gonna send that uh that link to you raw, so you can yeah, so I can start. Me. Yeah, right. exactly. Yeah. All right, that's all she wrote, y'all. God bless. Peace. Y'all have y'all have a good day. Pieces.